Yeah, it's me, um, Ben, or a kid, you can call me, from DRFPS. Today, we're going to be drawing, uh, what's his name? What, 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 what what's his name? El Goblino, thank you, thank you, Th thank you, editor. Um, today, we're going to be drawing El Goblino from Doors, so, uh, let's try it. This is not a tutorial, but you can follow along if you want. Personally, I don't really use paper for my sketchbook, but I can't find the, the, Okay, it's cleaned up, but personally, I can't find my paint pen paper, so this is the only paper I got, so we'll just have to deal with it for now. Alright, so first we're going to use this, I'm just going to use the orange marker for outlining, because I just, I can't find another dark marker, so I'm going to use the orange marker for outlining, just to draw this big old schnazzola first, so, uh, yeah, okay, uh, isn't it like, it's like, <laughs> I'm thinking of El, El Cerno de Fumo Goblino right now, um, but, doesn't he have little ears? And he has piercings too. This is going to be a practice drawing, so. Mm. Yeah. Uh, this is not looking good. <laughs> Let's draw um, something else. Uh, I'll draw you a nice background picture for like TRFPS. So let's do that. We can draw like 2023 at the top. Why is this marker like. This is the only pen besides the black one that does no don't that doesn't cooperate with me often if you know what I mean because I probably some artists that are watching this right now this is like you know I'm goofy. Okay, and that's what we're here for. Me and Jose, personally, we are just here to lighten up and show how funny YouTube can actually be. That's why we're on this platform, I think. I gotta ask him that. I'm sorry. You wanna know who our editor is? That's a secret. Anyways, now we're gonna do a nice yellow. <coughs> My throat hurts. It's been hurting for a while. And no, don't say, oh, then you shouldn't be drawing. Oh, then you shouldn't be up. Oh, just go. Yeah. It's just, I, 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 I'm okay. It's just a scritchy, scratchy throat. Yeah. I'm not sure if people even enjoy our content. But maybe I'm going to start doing Gorilla Tag videos and see how those do. Because I've seen, like, quite, I've seen, like, some of Jamie and Curly. Not a, not a mention, by the way. Just letting you know. And he, um, he looks pretty fun. Like, just swinging your arms around like a gorilla, you know? So, I'm going to get into that. And I'm going to see if I can record y'all a video. There's also this thing called ghost hunting in the game. Is it like a ghost mode? Like, creepy horror mode? I don't know what y'all, I don't know what people mean by that. But, looks like just like some fake stuff. You and like. Yeah, so, right. So we have that done. Gotta go draw the TRFPS logo. So I will see you when that's done. There you go. All right, so now we're going to draw the characters. If you don't know who the characters are, I'll explain them as I'm drawing them. And their personalities, too, as a bonus. So let's get into that. I'm going to draw them all with the green marker. And I might add some size to them since this is the most cooperative marker I have. First, we're gonna do all. First, we're gonna uh, try Jose first. Jose is one of the mo is the main character pretty much, and he's like he's like kind of cheery, you know. He has some. He has a memer. He's like funny, you know. He's not really a background character. He's more of like an important character in, in a way. Um, personally, though. Sometimes it, it, like, Jose isn't really in 
the front, and sometimes he's more in the back. But that's usually only when things get problematic. Um, yeah. Anyways, that's all day. So now, we're going to do Guy. And Guy is kind of the second character that was ever made for uh, for TRFBS. It wasn't always going to be called TRFBS, a.k.a. the Random Funny People Studio. It was going to be called... Originally, it was originally going to be called um, Jose World, but we thought that wasn't a good name. That might be like a good name for a little cartoon we might make. So we just went with uh, the classic um, TRFPS. When we were first making the group, we had no idea what to call it, and I made Guy look so goofy. Jose is about is I think. Four foot six, so probably be taller than him. And Guy is at least two or one foot tall, so you shouldn't have to worry about him. Besides the fact that he has a knife in his back pocket at all times, and is mostly murderous. So be careful with Guy. Guy will not be gentle on you if you are mean to him. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna like draw him like bloody, like he like you know killed someone. Even though that's not common for Guy. It's only if you anger Guy that he will pull out his knife and jab you. But he's like, he's like a porcupine. He's like, hey, man, don't don't keep poking at me. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stab you, you know? All right. Uh, I'm going to take a... I'm going to go get some water real quick. I'm back. Um, next, we got to do Sam and Gok. Gok. I don't know how to say his name. I could ask Jose, but... Um, I'm pretty sure it's pronounced Gok. Uh, I don't know. But he is, um, he's tall. Sam, Sam is tall. Sam, <coughs> Sam is like six foot, six foot eight. He's tall. Yeah, so. A lot of people don't really mess with him because they're like, oh, oh crap, that guy, he's so tall. I don't want to mess with him. And I really shouldn't. But Gok and Sam aren't really brothers. Neither are Jose and Guy. They're kind of just like friends, I think. But they hang out often a lot, so. I guess they're just like. And they kind of all came together just randomly one day, so I have no idea how it came out. But, yeah. And Gok, I know Gok looks like Bob. That He's short. He's very short. But that's him right there on the Sam, like next to Sam's leg. Um, but don't offend him for that. Come on, he was just, he, he's born with dwarfism. All right, don't offend him for that. Okay, Bill Small, Small, Small is basic. Uh, I'm not gonna draw him as small in this picture, but I will draw him kind of small. Small is basically like he's originally supposed to be an Adam like thick but i kind of wanted people to like actually notice him so i just put him in the background kind of just sitting there basically like a mini plus size like a full like a fumo size what's a fumo gonna do it's minus one foot tall Cerno, back away Cerno, get the hell away from me Cerno, Cerno, that Cerno just got a little get go away yeah sorry Cerno just got a little overreactive for that and you know I can't blame her. Uh, I I get gratefully offended for my height. I don't want to really replicate my height, but for a, for how old I am, my height is basically not appropriate, kind of. But I'm not going to replicate it. And this is the new character. His name is Huge, and he basically, he's kind of Small's brother, but not really. But when I mean Huge, his name is Huge for a reason. He's literally He's humongous. And the letter on his shirt is thick, is like in bold. So we gave him that just because, you know, because wanted to show how buff he is. And he is very buff. He is like, he works out. He's basically like a knockoff version of The Rock. But I, I don't think he'd be, he'd prefer to be called that, but you can call him that, but... I think you probably bite your ankles <clears throat> if you call him that. 
This is kind of more like a, a talk and draw. We should do this more often, a talk and draw, but maybe we'll do it with Jose next time at his house, if he's comfortable with it. Yeah, we're best pals. Uh, and we are probably going to have merchandise in, like a Jose plushie and a Kale plushie. So if you're looking forward to those things, then please like and subscribe or just show us some support in the way, okay? Because we we kind of want to be noticed. We just want to be noticed. That's all. It's not really, we don't, it doesn't have to be a goal, but we want it to be a goal. And yeah, I guess it kind of is a goal, but I mean, not a big goal because I mean, a lot of people want to be famous. That is a common goal, but we want to be famous in a different way. Famous for, famous for memes, you know, famous for memes because though we feel like we can replicate our, our uh, personalities in a way that it can basically, like, it can basically be like, I, I, oh my god, I feel like I'm at a TED talk here. It can basically be noticed in a way that people can be like, oh my god, those are the, the super comedy stars, Jose and Kale. They're, they're I'm, I'm, I'm not going to reveal my name. Actually, I already did. But you know what? I prefer to be called Kale, so please call me Kale. Um, But we just want to, like, we want when people to see us. We want them to be like, those guys, they cheer me up. They make my day feel better and everything feel better. We don't want to be noticed like, I was like, oh, look, it's the mean guys. All they do is make fun of people. Oh, I hate them. I wish they'd just like go somewhere else and like never come back. You know, we don't want to be like that. Even though some kids in our school treat us like that, we don't care. We just are there to treat pe we're just there to treat people the way we want to, and the way we want to is to treat them respectfully. Except for the kids that are mean to us. Sometimes we um we get them back. Not in a really good way. Some it's not really a good way. Like we get them back. We don't get them back how they get us back, but you know, if you don't understand. <coughs> <coughs> I give you some. Here's the drawing. Um, now it's time for the glamour shots, even though it's not really a good drawing, but uh, yeah. That's so much for watching, and if you want to show us some boy, actually, please like and subscribe because that will definitely help us. Um, hi.